To start off the makeup look, I am going to apply liquid latex with a spoon. I thought a spoon would have been easier to apply the latex. And then I'm just placing toilet paper on top and folding it over with the latex. To speed up the drying process, I'm using a hair dryer for a couple minutes. Next, I'm going to apply a second layer of the toilet paper and liquid latex. The total amount of layers I did was three. I just thought I would show you two for the video. Carefully I'm going to poke a hole through the latex with a pair of scissors and then as I'm doing that I'm picking it up underneath so it's easier to cut. Where I made the cut, I'm going to pull out the edges to make it look like it's more torn. I'm going to apply a foundation on top of that so it blends in with my skin color. All of the products that I am using, I will leave a list in the description box. To set that, I'm going to apply a translucent powder. I'm painting on a light red color inside the wound and on the edges of the latex. When I'm done with the light red, I'm going to use a dark red and just do the same process. Using a stipple sponge, I'm going to go around the wound with a yellow, purple, dark, and light red.
brush, I'm just going to fill in the cracks of the latex with a red and black. Lastly, I'm going to apply the fake blood. I'm going to use a stipple sponge, my fingers, and a spray bottle. Thank you for watching the video, I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel.